Well, hello and welcome to Beacon Hills Park, Turtle Island, Day 10, Action for Activism. Ha! This is Brent Space Talbot. See my home set up there in the background. My tent, I think you can anyways, possibly at this angle. Maybe I should move you over a little bit. There we go. This is where I live. Turtle Island, Beacon Hills Park, Victoria, B.C. Good to see you. Good to be seen. Day 10, no food. Woo-wee! Feeling groovy. Yes, my days have been interesting. They've slowed down. They've become more, more uh, on purpose. And because uh, I have to be very deliberate about everything that I do, it's very nice that we didn't have to take the tent down today. That's been the biggest challenge of this fast so far, is uh, all of the moving that we've had to do uh, with packing and unpacking, and the weather has been really challenging. The last two nights we had 70 kilometer hour winds, <laughs> so that's been a bit of a woohoo and lots of rain. But uh, we're still here, we're still doing it, we're still alive, and we're still happy, and I'm still learning, I'm still enjoying this experience. And I'm really uh, happy that I've taken on this challenge. It's uh, expanding my uh, idea of what's possible, definitely what's possible for me, uh, things that I can transcend, uh, things that I can do, and I can feel my body regenerating, rejuvenating. Uh, it's producing human growth hormones as I'm detoxing and detoxing all of my major organs, my liver, my gallbladder. And, uh, and I feel more alive. Uh, I know this is, uh, it, it, being outside is, is probably the biggest part of the challenge of this fast and uh, movement because we haven't had a ton of support. We've had some really great people, but everybody's doing their, they have their lives too. I love everybody that's come down to visit and to help and to, uh, to talk. And I thank you all. Uh, again, we're here at Beacon Hills Park. This is our last day today. Uh, next week we'll be at Centennial Square, uh, right downtown on Douglas, uh, right at City Hall there. Uh, we'll be there from Monday to Thursday. So if you don't get a chance to come down and see us, the weather seems to be breaking a little. This is the nicest day we've had, so we're blessed. I'm so happy for this. Uh, we'd love to see you next week. That would be fabulous. Come down and chat, uh, discuss fasting, do some yoga, meditate. Uh, you know, have a conversation, do whatever you feel like doing, um, draw a sign, make something, create, uh, just be at peace, whatever it is that you, that's good for you, and we're a lot more accessible downtown at Centennial Square, it'll be easier to find us than it is here in Beacon Hills Park, it's a huge park, 61 acres of beauty, hello, uh, Peacock just decided to walk by and say hi, uh, that's that's what I mean, like there's peacocks and ducks and seagulls all around. It's a beautiful place. Uh, if you ever get the chance, come visit. Come visit me at my home. I'd love to see you. Uh, it doesn't have to be today. It can be whenever you can get here. So I love you. Um, please uh, check us out again on Facebook, Action for Activism, Past, Present, and Future. Uh, also, if you want to check out... Uh, some more about me. My Facebook is Brent Talbot. Uh, so look me up there and I've got a whole bunch of other things going on. But this is my passion right now and uh, this is how I'm trying to teach through through experiential learning by teaching my, myself how to do new things um, and expanding my consciousness. So try it. Challenge yourself. Do something you've never done. You can do it. I believe in you. I know you can do it. I, I've done it, and I'm not special. I can I can do anything. These, I want to know what this meat suit can do. I want to see what this body can do. Ten days I've managed to go without food. Wow, that's some transcending. Transcending. Woohoo! But it's all psychological, because every time I start thinking about it, then I get worried. But every time I think about all of the benefits, that has happened into my body and I get back into my body and feel those things that are going on, I feel good about it again and I forget about all of that crap and I just get back to that place of peace and love, which is where I love and which is where I live. 
and which is where I meet you, right there, right here, right in your heart space. So, uh, open your heart, do what you're doing, um, come and visit, let's keep this conversation going. I love you, um, God bless you, listen to your heart. Namaste.